Hi everybody, it's Az here from Heel vs Babyface, part of TGN, Total Gaming Network, and I'm back at Dominance Point to continue the storyline from where I left off with Thrall last. And if you can remember, he and I had just reclaimed the Echo Isles back for the trolls. For the second time in my WoW life. Trolls, you need to control your city! I can't even get Lorder on back once for the Alliance. <laughs> Now, I've been summoned to Kunlai Summit, and more specifically to Magogia. And Magogia are those Mogu runes that lie between both the Horde and the Alliance camp there at Kunlai. But if you have a look at the quest text, you can see that I've been summoned there by the Regent Lord Lothram Arthuron. So that means we've got another member of the Horde hierarchy making an appearance in this storyline. We just need Bane Bloodhoof and Lady Sylvanas, and we've got ourselves a full house. But looky who else is here. It's Garrosh. And may I say, Garrosh, with his 523 million health. I know. I am not going to flick that guy's balls in a dark alleyway and then go, come at me, brah, anytime soon, let me tell you. Now then. We've picked up three quests, and they take place in Magosia itself. Now, I've been a, a big advocate of what I call progressive questing. And what I mean by that is questing that you get a, an end game that doesn't involve just repeating dailies over and over again and actually takes you through a specific storyline or through some specific lore. And so far, it's been going very well indeed. And I say so far because... The three quests with our, that I've got today, I've, I've got a problem. Um, I'm sorry, but I do have a problem with, and I'll I'll tell you why. Now, I quested here when I was level 87, and I think the vast majority of people have, unless you leveled up through dungeons or BGs, you most likely would have come here to Magogia to do some set of quests. Now, the three quests that I've been given today, two of them are identical to what I did when I leveled up. Firstly, I've got to kill the Terracotta Guardians. Well, we did that when we came here first time. The only difference is they were level 87 then, and now they're level 90. So that's just a carbon copy repeat. And then secondly, I've got to get the Corn Codex. Now, Corn is just stood or floating exactly like the Soul Caller was when we came here first time as well. Now, he has a slightly different mechanic during his fight, but that's it. So, technically, two of the three quests that we've got today, we already did when we leveled up, and it's exactly the same area. So, Blizz, you, you've done very well so far. What I have seen in, in patch 5.1 is, is very impressive. I am very, very happy with what I've seen. But, but this is... I'm sorry, I'm going to have to use the L word. It is lazy. If you want us to come back to somewhere that we've quested before, no problem with. that. That's fine. I actually think it's a really good idea that we visit places like Magogia and, you know, maybe some lesser known places instead of just always throwing us back to the shrines and, and whatnot or the temples. But if you want us to come back, then give us something different to do. Please don't make us rehash the same old stuff. Now, fortunately, this is a PTR. And I don't get any recognition when I hand the quests in for the progression with the achievement, the bigger achievement of the storyline. So I don't think this part is completely finished yet. So please, please, do, do change it. Do change it up. Don't make us repeat the same old stuff again. But as I hand them in, I hope you've enjoyed the video. So please do like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Twitter. And also, please do like my Facebook. And I shall be back with some more stuff very soon. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.